So you two, it's your boy King Say So, and I'm back. Before we get to it, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Check out the search box to find my channel. Make sure you watch the full video. Hey, this whole thing right here, though, I don't care. This whole thing is crazy, bro. First, a whole little, like, a whole little breakdown of something happened. Her, her brother. Then, days later, well, not even the days later, like, the next day, I seen a post saying, like, oh, basically, like, her father wasn't trying to explain what happened. He wasn't trying to <laughs> even talk about it. Like, bro, like, if something happens to your kids, that is, like, you you is kind of mourning, but still, like, that should be something that you, hey, like, what happened, bro? You won't have, like, no normal kids, bro. Like, even normal kids, hey, what happened? What's going on? Like, this, hey, I don't care. This whole thing is confusing and weird, bro. I hope she's okay and her brother, for real, for real. Okay, you guys, so it's been confirmed that Lil Tay is not dead. Now, before I continue with this video, I want to let y'all know if y'all hear any noise in the background, I'm in my car making this video. I live in Houston and it's 101 degrees outside, so I have to have this air blowing. But back to Lil Tay. So it's been confirmed that she is 100% still alive. Her brother Jason is 100% still alive. So she provided a statement to TMZ. She said, I want to make it clear that my brother and I are safe and alive, but I'm completely heartbroken and struggling to even find the right words to say. It's been a very traumatizing 24 hours. All day yesterday, I was bombarded with endless heartbreaking and tearful phone calls from loved ones, all while trying to sort out this mess. She went on to add my Instagram account was compromised by a third party and used to spread jarring misinformation and rumors regarding me to the point that even my name was wrong. My legal name is Tay Tien, not Claire Hope. Now Tay is claiming that she now has full access to her IG account and she thanked Meta for that. Now it's still a lot of questions as to oh why God, it took what? her so long to put a statement out there because she said she was very why you ain't went live yet? Why you ain't posted a video? Why are people just releasing statements? Like the first thing was a statement. The thing with your dad was statements. This is a statement. Where is a video at? I don't believe it until I see a video. And it gotta be a video of them with a regular background, not some specialized, like a house. It gotta be outside, dogs running around, something. Hey, <laughs> technology is crazy aware of all the rumors because she was getting phone calls but it looks like she possibly was because remember in my last video i talked about these two accounts that popped up after her death one was claiming to be her one was claiming to be her brother but both accounts were saying that they were not dead they were still alive so this possibly very well could have been her trying to reach out so i'm just gonna give that at this point a benefit of the doubt that she was trying in some type of way however just to be clear she has not said that it was actually her behind those accounts but i'm trying to figure out what was the reason what was the purpose whoever it was behind the account because there was not any GoFundMe. They were not asking for money. It was simply saying that she like, passed away. So it's definitely given suspicious. Okay, I'm really curious to. Oh, and oh, like that's crazy. And then too, it was like I seen um today. Make sure y'all follow Rich on Media too. I do have a blog site. I do post certain things. I did post about this. I just just didn't speak on on my platform because. <laughs> I was confused. I didn't know what was going on. So I was like, I'm not going to go speak on something I don't, that I don't know about. Bro. So I posted it, but it was, I was still like, spec, like, what's worth? I was still iffy on it, even even after I posted. Like, bro, like, some of these don't, they don't seem right. Like she said, they, they, didn't ask for, they didn't ask for nothing. It was just simply, this person has passed away. Condolences. We want to keep our, we want to uh, give the, our, the family some, some time to heal and all this type of stuff. Like, normal normal stuff that you know when something tragic happens like if somebody was faking something 100 percent it'll be a gofundme account it'd be like oh can you donate this she was she was a lot or we we didn't have no money for the bear or something like that so, so like hey especially like somebody famous you're gonna have a thousand upon thousand people flocking in to give money that that, that, that account probably would have made a million dollars with 24 hours less than that probably and then her youtube says help me in the bio I don't know when it, when that was updated because I've never looked at the channel, but I've seen it going around um, virus day that her the bio in it and the YouTube channel says help me. What is like what's really really going on, bro? Like somebody needs to go tap in with her family, like some real law enforcement. 
see if Tay is going to come out and actually talk about it and what is she going to say. But this is how fans responded. One person said, first Carly faked her kidnapping, now Lil Tay faked her death. Lil Tay faked her death for clout. The ultimate I got hacked excuse done by Lil Tay. That Lil Tay ish all for attention. Don't be fooled. This Lil Tay stuff is insane. I'm just baffled LMAO. And she's not the only one baffled because I'm baffled also and I really want to know what really went on. Was this done for clout? Was this done for attention? Were her parents behind the account? what is really going on with this situation oh God, i want to know how you guys feel about this how do you feel about everything being out on the table that this is not true tay is well and alive which is a really great thing her brother is well and alive that's great also but we need answers oh but God, i want to know how man. you feel so leave your comments below don't forget to subscribe and i'll talk to you later yeah i ain't okay bro that, that, that whole situation is weird it was always weird every time i ever seen a post about her her family it was always something weird, bro. So I, that's why I never really paid attention to him. She's too young for me to be paying attention to anyway. But it is still weird. Like when you become famous, hey, so everybody, everybody pays attention a little bit. So it, so for me to see that, it was like, bro, like I ain't seen this person. I ain't seen them post about this person or I've seen this person post himself in a super long time. It's been, it been a few years. So to see that after years of, of no posting, no nothing, that's crazy. The last thing I've seen... I believe that, that 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 they posted was that she was coming back to Instagram. She wasn't gonna be flashing the, the money no more because her dad didn't want her doing that. And so, it was something it, it was like she was coming out on some regular stuff, but that was it, and disappeared again. I don't know, man. It's crazy. <laughs> Get to the next one.